Excuse me, my lady. I'm sorry to impose upon you like this, but I'm in need of assistance, and I don't know what to do. My husband, Alaron, is missing. It all started when Alaron became foolish and started gambling. He'd visit the arena every week and spend our hard-earned money on bets. Smart. I told him to stop, but he didn't listen. He was certain he could win us a fortune and move us somewhere nicer, like the Imperial City. It didn't take long for Alaron to begin losing. He resorted to borrowing money from a usurer to cover his losses and place new bets. As you can imagine, it didn't pay off. He ended up owing around 500 gold. We could never have that kind of money to pay back the usurer. Yesterday, the usurer, Curden Grow Dragel, sent for my husband to meet him at the Lonely Suitor Lodge. He hasn't returned since. I fear for his life. Curden isn't known for his patience. Please, I'm not wealthy, but I'd give anything to see Alaron again. You... you will? Oh, thank you. Please be careful. I don't wish any harm to befall you either. I do miss him so. And when he gets back, I'm going to kill him for making me worry like this. Farewell and be... Listening to you. It's you. Have something to say, I, Dan. I don't like you. What's happening? What? I'm Hello. So Shouldn't you be so talking to anyone but me? Annoying. What is going on? Nasty creatures. Hello. But I hear their meat is rather. Somebody tasty. help! Come quickly. Yeah. What do you want? None of your damn business. I'd tell you if I liked you, and I don't. None of your damn. Make it quick. Every little bit helps. Maybe I know him, maybe I don't. But since you're so interested, I know something that could jar my memory. I just learned that a family heirloom, the Axe of Dragol, which one of my stupid relatives lost, is located on Fort Grief Island in Nibbin Bay. My informant tell me it's hidden in the main keep at the center. Don't know what's guarding it, but I'm sure you can handle it. If you go there and bring it back to me, I'll tell you exactly where Alaron is. Then Alaron may not be coming home from his, uh, journey for a very long time. Like, permanently. Whenever you're ready, and it better be soon, I'll have a boat waiting for you to get to Fort Grief Island. Time's wasting. He's safe for now. What do you want? Why do you bother me? Go away. Hey. Are you ready to go to the boat? Fine. I have it waiting for you at the dock next to the magic shop. Now get out of my sight. Yeah, it's a battle axe with the word Dragal carved into the haft. Huge. You can't miss it. I ain't gonna draw you a picture. Lucky I'm not making you swim. Go away. Oh, Jesus. He just died. And then the first thing I do is lose corpse. at Fort Grief. I should proceed inside the room and begin my search for the axe. But surely this isn't a trap. Is that would be pretty... pretty crappy, am I right guys?
Oh no. It appears as though Kurdan has tricked another poor soul with his axe story. Hmm. Figured. You haven't guessed it yet? There never was any axe of Dragol. It was just a ruse to lure you out here. I fell for the same trick. In my case, he told me if I retrieved the axe, he'd erase my debts. I was such an idiot to believe him. You're now the prey in Kurdan's insane hunt, just like I am. And here we'll most likely die. Clever ruse. I wonder how many have died falling for it. Kurdan doesn't make most of his money being a simple usurer. He also invented what he calls the Hunter's Run. People pay him a great deal of money to hunt and kill living human prey. No questions asked, and he takes care of the bodies. He uses the dungeons under Fort Grief as the hunting grounds. I was placed here because he knew someone would go looking for me. I'm sorry you got mixed up in all of this. I hope you can fight. It's our only chance of escaping alive. Don't bother. The door to this place is now locked. The only way to get out is by descending into the hunter's run and killing the hunters. One of them will have the key to the door. That's Kurdan's rules. It's the only way we can win. I wish I could help more, but I can't fight. I've never held a weapon before in my life. Please, get us out of here. I'm not a rich man, but if we get out of here alive, I'll do what I can to reward you. Kurdan is treacherous. Be wary, friend. It's not that hard. Well, well. Look who we got. We've got ourselves. What? Ah! Ah! Yeah! Ooh. Yeah! Ah! Yeah! Ha! Ah! Ah! Wow! Can do. Ah. Ah. I 
have defeated all the hunters. As a church for the body of the orc. I'm impressed that you killed all my clients. Doesn't matter. More will come along with their purses fat with gold and hearts lusting for blood. Too bad about Alaran. Didn't need him anymore now that you're here. At least now he's free of his debt. <laughs> Do you really think I could afford to let you leave here? The key you found is a fake. No prey has ever left this island alive. And I aim to keep it that way. You were right about one thing, though. This is my game, and I'm changing the rules. Yeah! <laughs> Elves are all the same, all flat, ah! and no fury. This ends here. I return to find Kernan. Standing over the corpse of Alaron, whom he murdered, I had no choice but to attack and slay him. I should return to Cur search Curtin's corpse for anything that may help me. and the orc hunter was indeed a fake and the real key was on his body. He'd never been he never intended to let us leave whether we won his demented hunt or not. The real key should allow me to unlock the gate room inside the hunter's run and then leave the floor. I will then have to bring Ursine the sad news. Yeah. It's what happened, it's what happened. 
cover this shirt as a memory. Oh wow. Need something? It's always a something's wrong. I can tell. What's happened to Aleron? He's dead. When I saw the grave look on your face, I knew something had happened to him. And what of that fetcher, Curtain? Then Aleron's death has been avenged. I told him that the gambling would lead to this, that foolish man, but he never listened. Before you go, I have this for you. Aleron told me that if he ever got in trouble, this could be used to bail him out of jail. He'll not be needing it any longer, and I want you to have it. I'll not take no for an answer. I know you did all you could, and for that I thank you. Now please, 
Go in peace. I wish to be alone. Quickly now. I'm at your service. Thank you. 